On August 5th, a concert was held at Artists Guild. A group of bands played to a crowd of Latino youth. This microcosmic event is a product of a larger phenomenon. What you are about to watch is a blunt reality of underground Latino music ranging from hip hop to rock. In San Jose, you can see kids with ripped jeans, long hair, riding their skateboards, dressed in black, with sewn on patches of clothes. Maybe they are not rebels or rockers without a cause, not like the punk rockers of the 70s, but their style and their image is marked by a do-it-yourself, I'm Mexican or Latin American attitude. They are the sons of immigrant Latino families. When you see these kids, they seem to carry something else on top of the as the system attitude. It might not be that they are fighting physically in a war, but their artistic outlook is a battle cry in itself. Music is the biggest form of identity. The term musica pobre has been thrown around since the last century. Artists ranging from Los Tigres del Norte, radio DJ Tlacoyo, hip hop artist Mixtape, and punk rock musician Manuel Santana give us today a perspective of what musica pobre means, poor people's music. Ciudadanos 